Hello, hello there, welcome to episode 8 of my Vice City Let's Play series, so we're back again. Oh, let's try and get a car. I want that bike really. Come on, oh. Oh. No, obviously not meant to be. We'll jump in a car. There's a police car right there. Do, 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 do. Jump in this. This will do. Now? I think there is a car in the um, garage, but we'll leave that in there just in case we need it. So, we're going to head to the back to the Vassetti Mansion Staffordshire and do some more missions. But we're just going to pop in here. How are we doing for... So we're going to get some body armour while we're here. Yes, we'll do that. Why not? That should be plenty. Should get us through the next couple of missions. So back to full health and we've got some more ammo. So yeah, we're just going to head to the mansion. Um, hope you're doing well. So, yeah, so far I'm really enjoying doing this series. It's so nice to play this game again after quite a few years. And it's been fun recording it as well. I've, um, yeah, it's been a little, little bit of a challenge, you know, as always is when you when you're doing something new but I've, in, I've enjoyed I enjoyed filming it I enjoy sort of having a go at doing commentary I've enjoyed editing the videos and putting it together and yeah enjoy just putting it out there it's been really good so if you you know if you're watching this I hope you enjoy it half as much as I enjoy making it and that's uh, that's good um, you know especially with all this whoop, especially with all this that's happening in the world the epidemic and everything um, if just watching this, just you know, even even if you don't watch the full video, if you watch it for 10, 15 minutes, it just takes your mind off things and helps you relax and and uh, then yeah, that that's great. Um, so yeah, moving on. So so these are kind of the main storyline missions. So we've done some of the side missions. We've done we've just done the love fist and the biker missions. So now we're cracking on with the sort of the meat and potatoes of the game. These are the kind of the main missions. So we'll pop inside. I've just realised we've gone back to the mansion. And I'll just quickly show you. You might already be fully aware of this, but it you know, if if you're not, we didn't need to go to the ammunition because down here. Yeah. There's a health and there's an armour, so you don't even have to pay for it anymore. You just have to go back to the mansion. So this is always a good place to save if you can. And then when it, when you start What's a new you start a new save game, you can you can top up for free. But anyway, enough about that. Let's start the first mission. What's the problem? Some bars refusing to pay. They reckon they're protected by a local gang of thugs. But don't worry, Tommy. I can handle it. You call this handling it? You two, off your asses. Let's go. Okay, this is my third attempt now at this mission. So we can't take Lancers in Furnace because we've got two dudes with us and that, that is a two-seater vehicle. So we've got this Sentinel, Sentinel, however you pronounce it, packed up there for us. So yeah, first time I got busted by a cop getting back into a car, the second time I blew myself up. <laughs> so I think that's the first time I'm oh no second time I've, ki I've killed myself first time was when I got stuck on the golf course couldn't get out and it was very early very early on in the game when the golf course was locked I couldn't get out so I, I jumped in the water in order to reset <laughs> um, so yeah I think I like to think I've learned a, a bit now for how the mission works I've, it's been the same bit every time second bit of the mission which I've struggled with so 
So I've tried two different things and both haven't worked. So I'm hoping now I've found a bit of a sweet spot and do a bit of the both. If that makes sense. So I've got these two guys coming up here. Just need to take these out. Oh. We've got a police car after us. So what we're going to quickly do. We're going to go down here. Now down here somewhere there is a police bribe. Somewhere. And if there isn't, we will go to a pay and spray because it's very important we have the police off our. Oh, sugar. That's okay. Where's this police bribe? Have I gone past it? I might have gone the wrong way. Oh, there it is. Let's get this. Yeah, we need. Yeah, that's, we can't be having two stars because we've got we've got more what were you trying to do, more, more destruction to do. So yeah, let's just have a look, see where the pain spray is nearest one. It's back. But let's. I think we'll be okay. We lost that lost that police car there. So luckily we're not being timed yet. So there we go. That's good. Okay, let's just go and talk to the owner here. Your protection needs a little more protection. Ah, oh, hell, not again! I don't need this crap. Damn hey, you, darling. chicken! Idiots operate out of DBP security work. around the block. You guys just sorted out among yourselves. I'll be seeing you later. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Well, that was cool. I've never seen that before. That guy roller skating, and then he sat down on that chair. That was quite cool. So last time I did this, one of the guys at this point just disappeared. Um, so I'm kind of glad we, I've got both guys with me now, because yeah, we need a bit, a bit of firepower behind us. So I'm just going to do this bit without talking, just because I keep getting stuck at this bit. And then if we do it, all goes well. I will talk a bit more. So here we go. There we go. Okay, let's get the car. We we're already in the car. Quick, quick, quick. If Right, I'm gonna have to leave that guy behind. Right, let's go. So obviously we've got the police on us, which is not gonna be make make this easier, but we're just gonna go for it, so. Two dudes on bikes. Here's number one. Okay, get up, get up. Right, there's one. Oh, Oh, three cars, police cars on us now, and we've got a big bend coming up. Come on, get all. <laughs> yes, yes, we've done it. Get it in. Ooh, so we've got rid of the police as well, which is good from passing the mission. Yeah. So the first time, I used the rocket launcher, blew them all up, and then the car disappeared. Tried to. Stole another car, but because of the kerfuffle of throwing a guy out and then getting in it, a uh, police car, a policeman came up, busted me on the spot. Uh, we tried it the second time, and I was stood a little bit too close to the uh, the car park or the, the sort of area where they were, because I wanted to I wanted to leave the car really close because the time before that the car disappeared, and yeah, I blew myself up because I was stood too close. <laughs> so. That's good, we've done that, so we're going to head back to the mansion now, save up. And then do the next mission, which I'm pretty apprehensive about, because this is one of the toughest missions that I can remember. So, yeah. That's, but we've got to do it, there's no point. Putting it off, there's no point. Oh, okay, telephone. Tommy, we got to talk about stuff. What's the problem, Lance? It's you, my friend. I feel you're not giving me a fair slice. And more than that, you've been embarrassing me in front of the boys. I can't have that. Lance, it ain't like that. You've been making mistakes. Tommy, I'm not your message boy. I'm not your running boy. Lance, don't screw up and we won't have any problems. I screw up, 
You can lay into me anytime. Tommy, I've done everything for you. You treat me like a fool. Don't do that. Lance, I won't rip you off or stab you in the back, okay? Just take it easy. This is tough enough without you getting all emotional on me. Trust me. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? I hear you, Tommy. But I can't take this much more. Lance, don't be like this. Now I'm warning you. Do you hear me? Just relax. Take a few days off. Okay? I'll talk to you. Okay, so Lance isn't very happy. So we're just going to quickly save... And then while we're here as well, we'll go back to the his first original outfit. With the back to the Hawaiian shirt, there we go. Just because, why not? We've been wearing that gash clothing for a while, so let's let's go back to the uh, back to, back to basics. Okay, so this next mission is called Copland. So when we, I'll we'll do the cutscene, and then when we drive to the location, I'll. Talk about why I'm a bit apprehensive about it. You moron! What were you thinking? Do you realize what this means? We could all be. So I don't know, the timer must have got screwed. That place was wired to go up like a firework factory. Then somebody tipped off the cops, but everything. What's the problem, apart. fellas? Mike was supposed to torch some place in the mall, but he screwed the fuses, and now oh, the yeah, cops are crawling all over it. We gotta get our stuff and get out of here. Relax, both of you. Let me think for a second. Tommy Versetti just doesn't cut and run. The cops are gonna be going over that building with a fine tooth comb, right? But that takes time. We gotta go in and torch that place ourselves. Yeah, but no one but a cop could get within a mile of that place. So we go as cops. We gotta get uniforms and we're gonna need a squad car. Well, thanks to you, Mike. I'm sorry. I got it. All we gotta do is lure the cops in with the finger, put them in a locker, and jump them. Good plan. Let's go. All right. Right, so. <laughs> okay, Lance, let's get the cops' attention. Is it just me and Lance? Or is that other guy coming with us? If, yeah, it's just us. Okay, we'll take the... Uh, we'll take the Infernus. So we've got to get a two-star wanted level. So I think the best way to do that would be to shoot a cop, right? That, that way you get instant two stars. So let's... We'll head to the police station. There's one. Really You're under oh, okay. So. You want to get arrested? Hey, get back here! Stop right now! Come on, Lance. Come on. Right. That's probably what we needed. Move. So, so we need to get two cops in a car to follow us into a garage. And this can be really, from what I remember, this can be an absolute pain. Because <laughs> normally in the cop cars, there's normally one cop in a car. But because, we, because we've got two-star rating, hopefully more cops will turn up. So we just need to get two of them in the garage at the same time. So here's the garage. So let's pull up in here. You ended up being a cop. Oh, is that car's in the way. Oh, right. So I want to get in that car. Don't make me run. Oh, oh, Lance. Come on. Guys in uniform, pal. Oh, see if we can do it. I did your wife, you poor bastard. Come on. That's one. You're obstructing police business. I got you covered. Your ID. Oh, there we go. Yes, done it. Okay. Tie him up and gag him. Ooh, fits perfect. I got a clean shot. Fit tight around the crotch, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mine, too. Mine, too.
Okay, so there is, should be a cop car. But yeah, it is. Fresh cop car, like sort of planted behind, which is like a little bit of a secret. So where's Lance? Oh, there's the cop. There's two cops. Oh, come on, Lance. Okay, so we need to go to the shopping centre now. And set up a bomb that that Mike guy set up, but it didn't. So there's cops all over the place. And what we need to do, we need to. Sh sh oh. Easy, brother. No cop drives this bad. Oh yeah, maybe they have to drive a bit more like a policeman. So they've blocked off the road, so no one but police can get past. So we're going to head down here, down this ramp. And what we're going to do. We're going to turn this car around. I'm going to leave it here so that we're going to set that up as. Oh, I can't talk. So that's going to be our getaway car. We're going to come out of this door and we're going to jump straight in that car as a police bribe straight ahead. Smile at the other cops. Hey there, officer. Nice badge. Nice badge. Real smooth, Lance. So we just need to head over and plant the bomb. I think it's at a coffee shop around this side. So where the pink blip is on the bottom left of the screen. Where's Lance? He has a habit of just stopping randomly and getting lost. So it's, oh, we've got two army dudes outside looking very serious. Okay, let's set off this bomb. Okay, timers are set. Five seconds and ticking. Five seconds! We to get the hell out of here! So we need to get out. Okay, let's go. Right, let's run. Car still there. Oh, Lance, come on, mate. Okay then. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Come on, Lance, let's go. Okay, good lad. We can't go to a pain spray. Yes we can. Yes we can. Let's jump in this car. Oh Lance, what are you doing? Right. Right, let's look for where the nearest pain spray is. It's further down here. So we've used a police bribe. Let's, oh no. Go down this way. This is not too bad because it's only four star. Since we've got a four star rating, we've not really had any issues so far, which is good. Let's pop in here. So when these stars are beeping, uh, blipping. Flashing like that, we just got to be on our best behaviour. Make sure we don't. There we go. Oh, brilliant! That went a lot better than I thought. I have read the game guide quite extensively on this mission. I looked because I remember this mission and it took me ages to do it. Uh, when you've got to get those two cops in the garage, they just wouldn't. They either did what they did at the start and they put a cop car in front of the garage door so it couldn't shut, or they just wouldn't walk in the garage and you had to keep going out and then Lance would would start faffing about and then oh to try and get Lance and two cops behind that behind that garage can be uh, a massive faff so but we, we did it which is, which is fantastic so yeah the, the, the first mission ended up being a lot more difficult than that one so that's good oh Same can't be said about my driving, because that was pretty uh, appalling. Okay. Okay, let's end the mission. Alright, brilliant. So those set missions are done.
Okay, so we've got 10,000 for that, which is good. And we've got a cop outfit delivered to the police station on the first map as well, which is nice. So let's save up. So I didn't know this, so I'll, I'll just read out in the game guide what it says once you've completed that mission. So it says, at this point, you need to acquire at least, oh, telephone. Tommy, it's me, Lance. Keep your mouth shut there, Tommy, because I ain't got no time to talk. I ain't interested in what you got to say. Why should I be? You don't care about me, do you? You got to look after me a bit better. Give me a spare slice, you know? Hey, Tommy, man, look, hey, I'm sorry. It's just that people patronize me all my life, treat me like a little kid. My brother would do that. Please, man, don't do that. I gotta go. So, you, yeah, Lance, it seems like uh, something else is going on there. Do you think he has a bit of a crush on Tommy? Because I think he does. So, as I was saying before Lance really interrupted, you need to acquire at least 60% of the possible assets of the game, as well as doing a few specific extra missions to trigger the ending, which I never knew, so... You need to go around buying a lot of the properties and doing the missions, so... We will go to the second map and buy a couple of properties which have missions in them, so... We'll do that. We might do one more mission for this episode, for this episode and then we'll probably leave it there but we'll buy a couple of properties first just so we've got them ready and lined up no I won't in fact we'll do we'll head to the taxi rank and do that first mission I'd like these videos to be at least half an hour long I think under that is a bit too short so I've had a bit of feedback from friends so I don't know oh. Alright, so just take a right here. And if I'm not mistaken, it's on the right hand side. Further down. Oh. We have got the Cuban missions to do, as you can see, but we don't want to do them just yet. I'm a little bit confused where we are. Okay, it's down here. Just because every time we if we do those missions now, every time we drive through this area, we're gonna get people shooting hells. So we'll do those missions last. So here's Kaufman Cabs. We're gonna bright Bry, Bry, we're gonna buy this property, so 40,000, let's do it. Guess you're the new owner. What are you, mob, cartel? You don't look Mexican. Anywho, I guess you better get on with the things are gonna change around here, crap. Maybe threaten one of the drivers. Go steady on Ted over there. He's just had his hernia fixed. Well, uh, yeah, things are gonna change around here, lady. Oh, crap, Sonny. Might as well leave this to me. I've been doing this for years. Now, here's this. We are now under new management, and things are gonna change around here again. Our new management needs... Which gang are you? Well, I'm not part of any gang, actually. What's your goddamn name, kid? Versetti. Tommy Versetti. Our new management, the Versetti gang, is gonna make sure we get no trouble. Capiche? Our... Did you like the capiche? I like the capiche. So this is how it's worked in the past. We run the firm as usual. If we get any trouble from rival firms, you beat the crap out of them. Then they beat the crap out of us. Then you beat the crap out of them, etc., etc. You got it? Uh, yeah. Yes. Just grab a taxi from the garage if you feel like jumping in. Okay, so we've now acquired this property and there is some missions, I think there's three and four. So I've changed my mind. We're going to leave these. Let me just quickly save. We're going to leave these missions till next episode. But what we are going to do, we're going to head to the boatyard, where there's you, you buy that and then there's one mission called Checkpoint Charlie. So we're going to, we'll do that and then we'll conclude this episode. So 
We'll just head over there. We don't want to run them. Them dudes over. So they're the Haitians, and then they've got the enemies, which are the Cubans. They've got they've got the white tops, and I think they wear like red bandanas as well. Okay, so it's just straight on down here, over to the dock, down to the docks. And according to the gang guide, there is only one boatyard mission, so I think that'll that'll if we do that, that'll kind of tidy this episode off nicely. So. As always, um, yeah, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you do, how you're doing. Let me know what you're up to. Um, let me know what you think. Okay, here we are. So let's purchase this. I guess you're the new owner. Yeah. Which one of the boats is the fastest? It's already in the water, dude. I thought you might want to try her out. Dude, she's already running with a 300 horsepower and engine. And a fiberglass hull. She just shoots through the waves. She can do like zero to 60 in four seconds flat, oh, dude. And she can hold like 20 bales of the best Jamaican yeah, smoke yeah. right in the hull. So go ahead, dude. She's ready to fly. Yo, yo, uh, suit dude. You got a light? Dude. Dude. Where's my car, dude? Dude, where's my car? <laughs> Those kind of guys. So we've got an option of two boats here. So is there a pink blip for us to do a mission? Okay, there's a save point there. Whoa. Oh, we're stuck. Let's go this way. I don't know if there is a pink blip. Or do we just jump into the boat and that'll uh, that'll trigger the mission, so Okay. And now the boats have gone missing. Or oh, am I looking? I need to go somewhere else. Okay. I'll tell you what, we'll save. And we'll try that again. So. What are you doing? Hey, Mario. Okay, they're still not there. That's that's annoying. Or is there a pink blip and I've just not seen it? Am I just being really stupid? Who brought us here? Oh, there we go, there's a, there, there's a boat. So let's see if it will trigger the missions. There we go. So yeah, just quite a standard mission, just uh, collecting packages until the time runs out, so. Whoa. So there was supposed to be an option of two boats. One was meant to be faster. Oh man, I'm rubbish at handling. So one's meant to have good speed. The other one's not meant to be as quick, but it's got better handling. I don't know which one I've got. It doesn't seem too bad. So we've got a ramp here, so we need to pick up a, bit, a fair bit of speed. Oh, <laughs> not that much. Okay. <gasps> oh, you are having me on. Okay. We'll try that again. Okay, so we've tried this mission a couple of times. If for some reason, I don't know why, the boats aren't spawning on the docks, so what we're just going to do, we're just going to go for a little bit of a wander and then go back, and that seemed to work last time. So we'll pop down there and we'll see if there's any boats there. 
come on. There we go. So let's try that again. So this is tricky, this one. Because... Oh, I would have... I would have... I might have rage quit then if I was out of the way. Okay, so... Oh, that's valuable seconds wasted. Okay, sorry I'm not talking much, I'm just trying to concentrate. This is difficult, this mission, so let's go hard left here. So we've got this one here, then we've got a ramp, but we don't want to go too quick because then we'll go over it, so... Oh! Try and line ourselves up with this. There we go. We need to get need to really speed up now because normally I've said in previous missions, oh, just take your time, go steady, and uh, you won't have any problems. Well, this one you really do need to kind of put your foot down. So I don't know how many packages there are, but yeah, I don't think I was. Probably got about two thirds of the way through before I ran out of time, so. I'm hoping though, the more I do these missions, as if I fail it, it might be a blessing in disguise if I have to do this mission four or five times, because hopefully by then I'll get better at driving boats. So, we've got this one here, and then we've got hard right, which is next, I think. After this one. So, we're going to take this right. There we go. I seem to be doing a little bit better than last time. So we got up to here last time and we, and we ran out of time. So we've gained 30 seconds, which is good. So let's keep on going. Let's keep this momentum going. Hopefully if we can get it done. I'm hoping it won't take us back to the boatyard because if we've got to go all the way back, there's no chance I'll get this done. Oh, running out of time. Last one, last one, come on, come on. I think we've got it. Yes. Oh, I'm happy about that. All right, so that one's done. So just the one mission for that one, which is which is good. So that was my third or fourth attempt on that mission. Third attempt, yeah. First time I crashed and the boat toppled over. The second time. <laughs> I ran out of time and then the third time we've done it. So what we're going to do now is probably going to be... Oh. Just about to say it's, it'll be quicker to go back to the mansion on Starfish Island, but I think... Where, where are we? I'm getting confused. Yeah, it will be. So yeah, let's go back. I, I thought we are at the other end of the map, but we're not. We're near the boat yet, but we're not right at the other end. So we're going to go back to the... Oh, can't go down that way. So we've got to go back to the mansion and we'll save up there and then we'll leave it there. So. Just make sure I'm going the right way. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I might speed this up or I might just, if, if I can think of something interesting to say in closing, I'll keep it in. Obviously, if that's for me to worry about, not you, so. Is there a better way to go here? Can I go straight? No, nope, just keep on going straight. Okay. Yeah, so we've got those missions done, which is a relief. It's nice to get them done. And I find the, uh, the taxi missions, the... Oh, what's going on here? Oh, look at that, the handling. Oh, that is spot on that. Much better than before. Hundred and seventy shotgun shells now, <laughs> so don't think we'll need to.
pop to ammunition anytime soon but there is a mission inside the ammunition not the target shooting practice which i would like to give it, give it a go maybe i'll do that in the next one the one after but we'll save up here and we'll leave it leave it here for today so as always thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it um if you enjoyed it hit that like button hit consider hitting subscribe and leave a comment down below yep yeah. thank you very much take care and farewell